have a Streamlit form demo. I have some text input, so something like, you know, I can enter my name here. We can provide feedback, hello world. We can do something like enter our date of birth. So we can go back here to, for example, let's just do like this 2014, whatever. So if you look inside of this code, you can see that we have, for example, text input, text area, date input, time input, radio buttons. Notice that we just uh, specify which radio buttons we want. We have select boxes, something like male, female, other. We have a slider and we can specify the different options we wanna have on that slider. Now, one thing to know about the forms, and you can see we've provided this with the width statement here, is that this kind of avoids the issue of constantly rerunning your script anytime a widget changes. When you put something inside of the form, like you've seen here, Streamlit will actually collect all of these inputs before it reruns the application. So what will happen is only once you press the submit button inside of the form, will it collect all of this data and then rerun the app. So you're not gonna have you know constant reruns every single time you're updating something within one of these forms.